From baby steps to the dance floor, one El Paso woman graduating from a long journey of physical therapy. Now she's looking forward to getting back her usual stride. KTSM 9 News reporter Stephanie Shields is in the newsroom with how she is celebrating this milestone. After a brain aneurysm left her paralyzed, Jennifer Parker went to physical therapy for 16 months in a wheelchair. Now she's ready to put on her dancing shoes and do the electric slide. Sliding into a new beginning for Jennifer Parker, who just over a year ago suffered a rare spinal cord injury, leaving her paralyzed. The paralysis was so severe that for a period of several days, and we didn't know how long it was going to be, I could not wiggle my toes. Wheelchair bound and in physical therapy for 16 months, Jennifer had to relearn how to walk, write, and other simple functions. I could not sit up on the edge of the bed, I could not raise my knees. Now, Jennifer wanting to celebrate her new first steps with a fun idea from her husband. One morning during therapy, he said, well, yeah, we should do the electric slide for your graduation. But she says the journey was far from easy. The pain is probably the hardest thing that was the most difficult to get through. There was just this inner battle of beating my, my, beating my best. Jennifer approaching each day with motivation from her physical therapist and loved ones. My goal was to get my therapist to go, wow, that's great, Ms. Parker. I can't believe you did that, Ms. Parker. She never said no, ever. If it was something completely crazy and whatever it was, throwing a ball to the trampoline or if it was picking up something from the ground, she never said no. Jennifer is now working to return to the activities she loved to do before the injury, saying she even signed up for a gym membership at Planet Fitness. In the newsroom, Stephanie Shields, KTSN 9 News. All right, Stephanie, thank you very much. We'll coming up.